Again, Carla Zeitlin has to make up a five second head start. T's best time, a full minute faster than Carla's. Up the Versa Climber they go. So tough, so exhausting, so stamina draining. Carla has nearly drawn even, however. T the first down the slide, but Carla right there. Now the hand bike. T looking strong. Carla hanging on, but now the ball pit. The most rigorous of the obstacles here in the Eliminator course. And as you have seen over the weeks, we have lost contenders in this sea of spheres. T over the first barrier. Carla jumps into the fray. This is where Carla Zeitlin has struggled in the past. That's why her time in the Eliminator best time a full minute slower than T's, but she's out of it in fairly fast fashion. Up the cargo net they go. Can Carla Zeitlin pull off the miracle? T composing herself now down the zip line. The one point landing, only two more hurdles remain. The plexiglass wall and then the treadmill, which we have cranked up for this grand championship. You want to be a grand champion, you've got to pay the full price. Look at T. Sorge pumping her arms, keeping her eyes up. She has done it. Carla Zeitlin goes down, but the day, the race belongs to T. Sorge. She's our grand champion for 1995-96. And Carla Zeitlin gave it one terrific shot. She just fell short at the end. T, you've done it. You've won the grand championship. You said to me, if you couldn't win, you wanted her to win. Absolutely, there's no one in this world I'd want to go to the finals if I couldn't go but Carla. <laughs> well, now the best news is you're on your way to Europe to do the world championship, a chance to see the rest of your family. Absolutely, here I come! Congratulations. T. Sorge, grand champion for 1995, and she'll wear the crown well. It's the mountain man versus the marine. Captain Richard McCormick has a three-point lead on Patches Mazia, but that is good for only a 1.5 second head start. Shizmazia also owns the fastest eliminator time this season, and the Marine knows it. He's with Nitro at the base of the Versa Climber. Captain, he's got you where he wants you. You're a little ahead, but he's got a seven second faster eliminator. Yeah, Pat's a furious competitor in this event. All I can do is give it 100%, and hey, I leave the rest to God. He'll work it out. Good luck. Two men in the run for it all, and we have cranked up this Eliminator course. Winner to take home $10,000. $25,000 overall in cash and prizes, plus a berth in the World Gladiator Championships later this year. Chismazia, Captain McCormick side by side. The Chiz has cut into the lead and has taken the lead. He's the first up. Flying down the slide. Powerful upper body, a great rock climber. Flying into that ball pit. Over the first barrier, Captain McCormick trying to hang with him. Pat ducks under a second one. He's the first out. Boy, he made short work of that. Future contenders would do well to study that technique. Pat Chismazia now on the cargo net. The 26-year-old snowboarding instructor from Ketchum, Idaho. Perhaps sensing that a grand championship is near. Two more barriers. First, the plexiglass wall. 
And then the treadmill. We've cranked it up several notches. Captain, Captain McCormick over the wall now, too. Here comes Chiz, pumping his arms, kicking his legs. He's done it. He's going on. He's won the grand championship. Pat Chiz Mazia from Ketchum, Idaho. This time, the fastest yet this season, one minute and 21 seconds. And absolutely no quit in Captain Richard McCormick. This guy has been one tough Marine. Pat Chismazia, look at his face as he scales and pumps his way up the treadmill. He had his eyes on the prize. Pat, once again, you had him where you wanted. You came from behind to win this thing. I absolutely, I had him right where I wanted, second half back. I can't believe I beat him up, the first climber. I love the balls. And uh, it, was, it was that two scoops advice on uh, the two yeah. grass right before the, the, the throw it, yeah. Whatever yeah. it's called. <laughs> and uh, there, there it was. <laughs> Let me tell you, in your own Forrest Gump kind of way, you have won the hearts of all the gladiators and all the fans. Congratulations. <laughs>